Okay, it says I... <gasps> Someone followed my channel. Very nice. Okay, it says I should be live. Sweet. Okay, I don't know if this thing will tell me if anyone's watching or not. I might just have to use my phone for that. But... Looks like I should be good. Move over here. Okay, let's see if there's any viewers. That's fine. Um. So yeah. I think the mic might just be picking up weird movements. I'm, I'm set up very odd. <laughs> but uh, it'll work for what I'm trying to accomplish. And yeah, may as well just move it here. Play some Deadly Premonition. Which I've never played before. So we'll see how it goes. Don't know what to expect. <laughs> nice. Thanks, stream elements. Let me actually mess around with some. These graphics, though. <laughs> oh, my gosh. It's dangerous to run around here, boys. Grandpa. This was like a PS3 Grandpa, game. Why it be looking like this, though? Oh my gosh. Oh, I have a viewer. Wait, hold up. <laughs> I don't know what my, my mic keeps picking up something. or whatever let me know how sound is because yeah wataru nishide yeah it was kind of creepy but <laughs> she dead, bruh. Oh, damn. Hopefully this game is like... <laughs> find a way. <laughs> I don't know anything about it. That do be a snake though. Oh, 
technically this one's called Deadly Premonition Origins, which I don't really understand why it's specified like that. Did I see that right? Oh, that was the the thing. I thought I thought the kids just started full on. I was so confused. <laughs> Bro. Oh, my mic's like sensitive. Hold up. Oh yeah, the stinking game was up. Oh, <laughs> screen went dark. My B. Let me turn the gain down. Okay, there we are. Okay. Shmito, someone's dead. Auto save can't change. Control setting, aim setting, revert camera. I don't know. It keeps saying my mic's picking something up. I don't know what it is. Okay, it stopped. That's fine. It's probably just my computer being noisy. Nope, it's not being noisy. So I don't know, probably a ghost. Okay. Uh, yeah. Um. Controller sound. Oh, you can change everything? That's kind of cool. I'm gonna leave it as it is, though, just because I don't know how this game works. It's gonna be a mix between Silent Hill and like, I don't know, Resident Evil? Why did I buy this? <laughs> Hi Adam! I have a viewer! Hello! We're playing Deadly Premonition. So far some girl's been found dead on a tree. <laughs> I hope it's fun. I don't. I bought it because it was on sale. Just a little long. And uh, you know, because I'm a sucker for when stuff's on sale. So. This won't take long. I don't really know what it's about. It's about a murder. <laughs> So, what is this? Is this the one you traded an Evangelion for? No, that's Xenoblade. No, I haven't... No, that's Paper Mario. I'm thinking about trading in Xenoblade 2 for Paper Mario. Even though I bought the DLC. Yeah. Even though I bought the DLC for like 20-something dollars. I... 
the game is something, and I'm excited for the new Paper Mario game, so I'm trying to figure out if it's worth taking like 20 bucks off for. Packed with eggs or the ducks. <laughs> I'll take that into consideration. I don't know, I hope the new one's not boring. Sticker start, the 3DS one sucked. And I heard the Wii U one was good, but I never played it because it didn't. It seemed too much like Sticker Star. Uh, well, the best Paper Mario game is the one on the GameCube, Thousand Year Doors. So if you ever want to play one, just play that one. You don't. That one or the 64 one. What the? I don't know what I'm doing. Jaren, I don't know who I am. Hi, Jaren. Turn this light back on. Because this game's too dark and spooky. Locked door. I. Yeah, I know it's Jaren. Hi, Jaren. Uh, I don't know who I am. It says York in the top left. I guess I should look at my my menu. Yo, what is this menu screen? <laughs> what the heck? Oh my gosh. Okay. I have items. Okay, items. Map. Oh, that's cool. I, I, I don't know. It's called Deli Premonition. Uh, in the intro, which I mean I haven't gone anywhere. I can go back and just replay the intro. I guess. Uh, we found this guy was out with, like I'm guessing his, <laughs> Deli Prem, Deadly. Sorry, I talk fast. Deadly Premonition. De technically, it's called Deadly Premonition Origins. Uh, even though it's actually just Deadly Premonition, they just changed the name. Oh, that's cool. Okay. Uh, but yeah, I don't know what happened. We found a dead girl on a tree. And from what I've read online and of the game description, it's about uh, a murder. So, I guess Japanese Twin Peaks or something? I don't know what to do. Okay. Could you wait? Just a little longer. This won't take long. Will it though? What the? What? Is there anything else I can talk to? Doll shit like a fat man. Oh, okay, that was it. Sorry to keep you waiting. It will start soon. What will? It's about time to get started. What? Does everything sound fine? Like my voice in the game audio? Zach. Zach. Oh, my Zach. Can you hear me? Zach. It's me. York. York. If you can hear my voice, could you respond? Oh, shoot. Answer. <sighs> okay, yeah. cool. Thank you. I thought you went to sleep. Wait, so am I Zach? No, don't be surprised. The crime took place out in the country this time. Let's take it slow. Yo, what? Okay, Zach? That's one way of looking at it, but it's totally wrong. Francis York Morgan, FBI special agent. Heck yeah. Listen, they both need each other. It's called interdependency, and they both know it. <laughs> that laptop. Yeah, I know. He does terrible <laughs> it's things. It's like the display Tom. laptops they have at IKEA. Things. But that's fine as long as that's what Tom wants. Think of it. His actions. He's always asking for it. It's his partner's job to fulfill that need, and Jerry knows that. 
I do appreciate the lack of lip sync. Well, in the Tom and Jerry show, they live with each other. Hello? Hello? Back. I can't believe the Bureau still can't get me a satellite phone. Yeah, this game has blood. And the girl on the tree was naked, but you couldn't see anything, so me I should be fine. But I did get Loki yeah. scared. For a second, a waste of time. I'm glad I'm not playing Castle uh, Castlevania Zach? Symphony of the or sh uh, the one on Xbox. The from the last case was something. No, Jaren, come back. Jaren, if you have to leave because of blood, then you have to leave your body because it's got blood in it. I now have a scar to show off. <laughs> I got this when I arrested the cat woman wannabe. The <laughs> girl at the beginning was just a lenity. Don't you agree, Zach? I know. You have to astral project now. Y'all mind if I just astral project real quick? Oh no, his lighter's not working. Turning the lights on. Give us <laughs> I'm sorry, was that a monkey? <laughs> Did those squirrels make a monkey noise? <laughs> I'm so That's a subspecies of squirrel. Squirrel cam. I heard a monkey noise. I swear. Bruh, I gotta turn the brightness mm -hmm. down on my laptop. To, to make it spooky. There we are, now I'm royally spooked. This man's car just crashed and burned and the first thing he does is lights a cigarette. Bro, same. Zack, here goes the civilized world. Oh, I'm Zack. Okay. I I think I've seen like a let's play of this game before, because that opening sequence look kind of familiar. No, I'm York. Okay. Select open. Oh, select is quick. Snap to your map. Okay. Go to Green Belt and do this. Will do. Toolbox where I keep my stuff. What are my... Oh, okay, third person. Can't walk, fun. That's run. That does nothing, that does nothing, that does nothing, that does nothing. Ah, quick. <gasps> Yo, oh my gosh, it is Resident Evil. It's like Resident Evil mixed with um, Twin Peaks. Interesting. Oh, 
Oh, okay, so you can't just use your weapon. <laughs> what? Did I get money? Okay. Interesting. Combat seems kind of rigid, but that's probably intentional to make you feel like you're having to fight for your survival. I imagine. Start profiling. Oh, that's not good. I'm sorry. Looks like we're being welcomed. Zach, I'll let you handle the meet and greet. Wait, who is Zach? How do I unequip my weapon? Okay. Oh, he'll unequip it himself. Okay. Where is my flashlight? It's on my breast pocket? What? I don't really need it. Is this collectibles? Yo, let's go. Alright. Alright, let's just go. Oh, that's weird. So your stamina meter, it builds up. Okay, interesting. Oh, huh? bro, he'd be dead. Banjo-Kazooie. <laughs> this was what Microsoft wanted Banjo-Kazooie to become. Okay, never mind. I was gonna do something. Okay, never mind. Can I... I thought it was going to force me into a combat scenario. Hmm, so much for my hopes for a peaceful picnic. Give me a favor and stay sharp, Zack. Who is Zack? Am I just dumb? <laughs> Zero out of ten. <laughs> it's a dead dog. You, you cannot pet the dog in deadly premonition. Yo, that is a ghost girl if I've ever seen one. I have a lot of stamina. Can of pickles. <laughs> what a collectible. Control panel for the power grid. This should give us the electricity we need. Not an expert at any of that. Okay. Uh, no, I've never actually seen a ghost girl, unfortunately, so I'm, I'm assuming that's what a ghost girl looks like. I'm hoping, though, that that is what one looks like, or else I'm going to look like an idiot. Oh, snap. There she be. What? I'm sorry? What was that noise? <laughs> Okay, cool, it auto-equips the gun. Rubber skin, o obviously. What is this cutscene? Mysterious shadow? <laughs> what? Okay, I got a, I, I got a key. Put the F and draw with L, draw A, what the name? Draw weapon and lock on with C. Wait, they got lock on? Okay, that's kind of dope. Nice shot. Did I win? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> it it had mixed reviews when I was like looking it up, and there's a sequel coming out. I think that's why it was on sale. Um, I'm. Oh crap! Great. Okay. Great. Yeah, it's on Switch. It's on, um, it was a PS3 game. I think, like, PS3, Xbox 360, like, early, early. And it was ported to, it got a port. 
you win color. <laughs> it got a port called Deadly Premonition Origins, which I don't understand why, because it's not like a prequel to the game. It's the exact same game. Um, and yeah, there's a sequel coming out soon. Oh, sorry, I got a problem. There's a sequel coming out soon, so I think it was on sale to kind of like bring attention to that. But I think it got like cold status. Online, it. What I could read of reviews online is that the story was praised, but the combat, but that with Deadly Premonition, or it stopped deadly. It's the first time I've Sorry, been I talk so fast. No, th there's no colon, though. Can you I give me a logical I think it's just one, that was? one whole word. Or, not word. Never mind. mind, don't answer. Life is fun because of the mysteries. But yeah, I. Right, Zach? This game. This feels like a game that would have a cult following. Um, wait that later. Aw, oh, yeah, a lot <laughs> You're fine. <laughs> Sorry, I talk fast. Oh, that's cool. You say about the telephone rules. Just like in Earthbound. <laughs> Delhi Premonition. <laughs> I like the idea of Deadly, of, of Deli Premonition, and it's a sandwich artist who can see dead people. I feel like, I feel like that that could work. Oh sh! Why does he take forever to get his gun out? Aim. Aim for the head. Oh, headshot. Ah, okay, so headshots give you the purple. Good to know. Uh, I don't hate this combat so far. I'm, I'm guessing it's... Why would I push that? What? <laughs> he has the order before you will. <laughs> I like that. A psychic sandwich artist. A very powerful psychic who just wants to live life as a sandwich artist. Oh, I guess I should push this crate. <laughs> Unfortunately, he's not dead yet. Okay, stop. Stop pushing. Can I auto aim with this? Yeah. Yeah, nothing. I'm wondering if. Dickery. <laughs> I'm wondering if the director of this was the same guy for Resident Evil. I didn't. I might have seen something like that somewhere. I didn't. Oh shoot! That's why they're called shadows. Okay. Good to know. Okay, that auto assist is kind of. I might be cheap when I use it. Shot. Great. Headshot not kill? Oh, it just gives me. Oh, it does kill me. Okay, well, hopefully I can find more items. I can throw the pipe. Nice. I don't. There, there was a murder. The story is that there was a murder of of a girl. There's an enemy somewhere. Uh, there was a murder in like a small town and so I'm sent to investigate and I'm guessing it's like there's more to the town than just the eyes like transport my pipes about to break dang that did a lot of damage too we're gonna break that. Yeah, I, I'm. It's just like you're a detective in a town, and we're gonna use the knife, which is so much weaker. Hey. But you probably take more. Jesus. 
said no. <laughs> he goes, nope. Not today. I don't understand how this health bar works. Dang, if only I had a way to break the lock. Can I break the window? Dang, if only I had a way to break the window. Okay, I don't know what to... Key item there, key item there. There's a box here. This way. I didn't even notice this shed. This was the shed I was in. Okay. Oh no, this is different. Oh yeah, no problem. Sorry, I <laughs> I didn't read what you wrote in, in your Discord server and I felt kind of bad. <laughs> the harpsichord though, yeah. But I'm glad this is cheering you up. The generator looks really bad, Zek. I think the killer really had a grudge against you. I have a bunch of other games on my Switch I also want to stream. I got, um, yeah, profile. Only Memories 2048 or something. I can't remember. I got that because it was on sale for a couple of cents. Okay, cool. Uh, and I want to stream that one too because I know nothing about it. I think uh -huh. all I know is that the developer had some controversy or something maybe if I'm thinking about the right person. Uh, but I got that because it was on sale. And I want to have a bunch of games on my Switch that I buy because they're on sale. And I like wasting my money. But I want to try like streaming them all. The way I kind of have a reason to play. Do I? I have limited in the play, don't I? What is this box? It's like the nether. Like like the, the those Minecraft chests that can like hold stuff everywhere. Okay, there's the phone. This is where I started. I came down here. That's a dead end. Came down here, came down here. These are all. Oh, oh my gosh, I just turned on the generator. <sighs> no, put the pipe away. Whatever. I turned it on. Did I not turn it on? I guess because it was broken? I missed what I did. Oh crap. Okay. Did I get a key? Or something? Fuse box. What? I picked up the fuse. Okay. What is the fuse box? Short, short circuit the lock. If I hit it hard enough. Oh, actually, you have to just hit it. I'm an idiot. That's fine. You learn something about yourself every day. Dang, that's crazy. I don't want to lose you. Oh, frick. Alright, goodbye, Clyde. Dang, I like that. Okay. <laughs> Psychically places fuse box or fuse. I need the door open. <laughs> the sound of the monsters make it's so weird. Uh, I'm almost out. Oh, this thing is like an oh, like a diva system.
Okay, so headshots do kill me one hit, so I was just wasting bullets like a moron. But that's fine. You know, you learn. It's survival horror. I'm supposed to feel rich. I don't like, though, that I can't... Amazing. Holy crap. Nothing gets past him. Oh wait, hold on. I gotta get my, my collectible real quick. There we go. Seems the car crashed into the, the electrical sever severing power. Like the nuisance, huh, Zach? Where'd the driver go anyway? Why did he just leave his car? I don't know, because it crashed. Sir. Oh, snap. Oh, sorry. Just, yeah, I think. Why, why is, why is pushing it a thing I can do? It's not like I can jump. Okay, you push it that way. I gotta be careful my knife's about to break. They're not dead? Oh, screw it, I'm not. Okay. So she's dead. So is he. Okay, what did you draw? Can you... What did you draw? Thank you. What a game. What, what a game. I put my gun away, wasted my pipe because I thought I was out of bullets. Hunger. I didn't notice that. There's hunger and sleep meters. the killer. Oh, I missed. Oh, no. The game excuse me a game over. What's he look like that? I'm sorry. Please don't take me back to my last save. No. Okay, it didn't. Okay, thank God. Uh, 
Investigative failure. When I die, I wanted to just say investigative failure at my funeral. Did they take two hits to kill? Bullseye. Yes. Some of these guys are kind of cool. I guess I gotta investigate. I will say though, it is kind of freaky that they can just like teleport. I don't like that. Also, there's just a bunch of like country. I almost said something else. Or country heads. You can see the invisible wall. Oh my gosh. Wait, hold up. You can see the invisible wall. <laughs> oh, that's so good. Oh, also his flashlight <laughs> is just this little bit right there. <laughs> that's so ridiculous. game is wacky. I, I kind of like it though. <laughs> Even though I haven't played it for long. I'm, I'm low-key enjoying it. Oh snap. You got red ivy. I've got my three clues. Now I can do my level three hyper clue. I can start profiling people. There was a burger. That's it. Okay, cool. We did it. We profiled. Ladies and gentlemen, we got him. Take a sip of my drink. In, in victory. I'm scared to do anything during a cutscene. There's definitely something in this town. Because now I know... You feel it, Zach? It's no longer a low key. Coffee you were right. I, I made Yesterday morning, the milk game. I poured in my coffee made a sign. It said, Tomorrow you'll arrive in a place that will change your fate. I'm sorry. Your coffee did a what now? Okay. Oh, wait, what? Oh, I'm out of there. not get a car that I came in? No? Okay, I guess we're running. Oh yeah, this game's also open world, so this will be fun. Thank god that my stamina is ridiculous. Oh, hold up. There we go. What are these? This game of collectibles. <laughs> this is what Banjo Kazooie always wanted to be, but never could. <laughs> now I want there to be like a, a mystery horror action collectathon game where like there's just zombies and monsters and it's scary, but also you collect coins. 
No, you were very late. Emily Wyatt, Greenville Deputy Sheriff. I didn't think you'd keep me waiting in the rain for so long. FBI Special Agent, Francis York Morgan. Oh, he's FBI. Please, just call me York. That's what everyone calls me. Agent York? Good, that's good. <laughs> that's what he said. Are you the sheriff? Uh, no, I'm Deputy Sheriff Emily Wyatt. George, he's the sheriff. He went looking for you, actually. He should be back soon. Thank you. If you don't mind me asking, did you walk all the way here? My car broke down, that's all. <laughs> she, she was the killer the whole time? Actually, I'm kind of worried that that might actually be the case. Though I doubt it. I doubt they're gonna have the, the villain be the person, like someone that she the character knows. On the eyes. Definitely worth a trip to the primitive world. By the way, don't mention anything about what happened back there. Psycho. Okay, this guy has to be like. Don't want that, do we, Zach? Schizophrenic or something. Welcome to Greenvale. I'm the sheriff, George Woodman. <laughs> George Call Woodman. Hair's <laughs> the same color as your skin. It's just an extent. <laughs> it's like the Simpsons. FBI Special Agent Francis York Morgan. Got that Simpsons hair Please, going on. Just call me York. That's what everyone calls me. I Could like the vibes, the though, FBI of so it being, like, an FBI homicide? agent sent to, like, this just small town. Let's just say it's a personal interest in killers of young women. I'm always looking for new But also, I don't understand why there Both were ghosts. Acquainted with each other. You can remain in but hey, I guess it was a, a problem with this, deadly you? premonition. No. No ha ha. Just want to set things straight. Our small town has its share of problems. I'm the one fixing them one by one and maintaining peace. Yo, that was kind of cool though how he like examples, lit that cigarette. But I need you to understand that. <sighs> of course. Of course. By the way, George, I had a little accident with my car. Could you send someone to take care of it? <laughs> George oh, Woodman. Close <laughs> what a time. last name. All right. I'm the man of wood. Woodman. I'll get my assistant Thomas to take care of The funny thing too, Woodman was a, a boss in Mega Man 2, I think. Do you need anything else? Now I just want George Woodman. Jaren, are you Thanks. still there? Could you draw Woodman from oh. Mega Man 2? I'll stop first at the hotel. But as George Woodman. Then I'll join you on your investigation. If you're there, please. Don't know how to say this. But, uh, <laughs> Thank I you. Really don't need your help. Unlike some of your corrupt city police officers, Play it by the Sorry, it says. I hope you'll come to that. <laughs> it says on this one thing I have one viewers. So and we'll handle the whatever. investigation. You just think of this as a vacation. Take it easy. Enjoy the nature here. I you know you were just killed by ghosts, but think of it as a vacation. Wildlife. Just calm down, buddy. Zach, let's reassess Aww. the situation. I uh, wish that were real. Here. Or true. Middle ages. No, but I think my we phone's just, just being stupid. The king. Oh shoot, PS4. Let's go, boy. Not that I have one. Though. Yo, that's cool. Ways to continue. Oh, yeah. Basic wage, unpaid salary. What? What? Okay. Nice. Okay, it does have low durability. So it. Ah, oh, gotcha. No, no, I wasn't trying to. Oh, sorry, Zach. To you. Previously, during the sorry, I wasn't trying to say that you were flexing. Go to I just, I'm happy people are watching. But gotcha, I will keep that in. Yeah. So Welcome. I'm the sheriff. Okay, so this is this is set up like like a show. 
like a small town Middletown. mystery show like Coffee. Twin Peaks. I'm guessing I haven't seen Twin Peaks yet, but I'm guessing kind of they probably took inspiration from that. Okay, Angel Ice Sack. Take item. A trading card? I'm sorry, who is this child? Okay. Sugar donut. Get it? Because I'm a cop. Or FBI agent, but... Same diff, I guess. It wasn't locked. It was it was unlocked the whole time. You a fed, bro? That's why you gotta get them donuts. That's actually what they pay him in. That that money it was showing was the monetary value of the donuts he's gonna get. But if they put enough gold on the donuts, they don't have to actually give him more than one donut. York. York. It's a child. <laughs> Killed the mood. He's telepathically Hurry. talking. Like this. Of course, How like all little boys do. As someone who was once a little boy, I I could talk telepathically to people. Is this a mechanic I know now to hold my breath? You know what this feels like? This feels like a David Cage game. Mixed with like Resident Evil. Like if David, it, if Beyond Two Souls, or not Beyond Two Souls, uh, Heavy Rain was directed by the guys that directed Resident Evil. Okay, do I just slip in here? I am holding my breath, sir. What was that transition? What was that? Oh snap, he's under the sheets. That they don't usually do that in video games. That bed is massive. What the heck? Zach, the symbolism in my dreams continues to intensify. A forest of red trees, a carpet with red leaves, a strange doll, and twin angels. But that child is what bothers me the most. I swear I've seen him before. 
just can't remember where. Well, that'll probably come back to me eventually. For now, we need coffee. Zack's gonna be important to the story, I think. Let's head to the cafeteria, Zack. I hope they have some real coffee. I really need some coffee. Then we can head to the sheriff's office. There's a proper procedure for everything, right, Zack? Oh, these hallways are spooky. First floor, and I can save twice. Oh, you have to pay to save? Interesting. Maybe. That'd be cool, though. Oh, you do. Oh, that's cool. I like that. But then I got twelve dollars back, so. Oh, that's cool. Wait, I'm sorry, how much for... <laughs> I don't know. I think... He's talking to someone named Zach. Who... We don't... I don't know who Zach is. Unless if he is like some sort of spirit. But also, the these prices. I'm sorry, $31.50 for black coffee? Inflation? <laughs> I know. <laughs> what is this? Like, I, I can understand if it was because they converted it from like... Some other currency, but that's... Unless if I'm buying... Even if I'm buying five lollipops, having your lollipops be like under five bucks a lollipop is ridiculous. I bought crackers for $35. I think you get it. Do I, okay, do I get four? Is that what it is? This is Trump's America. <laughs> These prices. Okay, so you get four. Still, that... I, I didn't even need that. Well, we will see how hunger works. And I hope that the hunger thing isn't just like, if you're hungry, you start taking damage. Like, they actually do something interesting with it. Morning, Mr. Morgan. Your breakfast is ready for you. Lady, stand up. Thank you, Mrs. <laughs> Polly Oxford. <laughs> I didn't know you could clip quotes. That's cool. Thank you, Polly. I'm starving. That's cool. I'm glad that that's something that can be quoted of me. I'm gonna make that my uh Is everything all right, Mr. Morgan? Oh, there's a collectible. Oh yes, admire. Yes. Make it's that my bottle. my bio. My compliments to the chef. I'm hoping Twitter. my cooking will bring back repeat guests. Oh Honestly, you typed it. Though, okay. Well it showed up red. I couldn't help but notice. Oh, okay. I'm aside from you and me, there seems to be no other guests I do or be workers around. What's that? The salt's in that white shaker there. Thank you. I was wondering if there get were it? any because other she's old. guests or workers here. Oh, no, so she misheard and thought he was asking My about salt. I used to run this place, it's but funny. He's in heaven now. You've been working here alone since then. It must be hard by yourself. Oh my. We're all out of pepper. I'm very sorry. It must be difficult to run a hotel by yourself. Well, yes, I suppose. I could just live on my pension, but I have to admit, running a hotel is kind of like a hobby of mine. That's nice. P 
Polly, it might help to hear you better if you could sit a little closer. Oh my, Mr. Morgan, you're embarrassing me. So early in the day, too. I think I'm a little too old for you. And I still love my departed husband. May God rest his soul. <laughs> hey. I appreciate the invitation. <laughs> can we I'm get a ban in chat for that? Polly. I can no pun. Hear We're you kidding. From all the way over there. <laughs> That's a good one. You're exaggerating. This is fine. It's no duty to be all clumped together with such a large table and cafeteria. We have to make use of all this space. <sighs> what is this music? Now tell me, that wound on your face, what happened? Let's just say I had some trouble during the last case I was working on. I'm sure it'll heal. It's just a flesh wound. Oh my, well, there's no need to be the tough guy here. <laughs> oh I want no. you to be able to he's, relax. He's I've in, a special room he's in a hotel. A famous rock star I don't know. In the same room, you know. I do like, though, really? that, that WT Frick I feel uh, if you need anything, was anything considered profanity. All, let me know. Thank you, Autobahn. Oh, that's pretty cool. St. Polly, what can you tell me about this town? Well, let me see. You might know this already, but the town is called Greenvale. It Damn, rains here crazy. quite often, but it's a nice place, surrounded with nature. It was a big and prospering lumber town until not so long ago. We used to have a population of over 6,000 people. Um. More than a tenth of them. Thank Frick this for hotel Twitch was built back then. We saw plenty of I'm turning the, the music days. down when I get a chance to suspend. That's why this really place is so big for such a small community. I, have so many I don't know what we do with that auto mod. Not have to click accept when someone says WT Frick. Clock? Oh yes, it's lovely. It rings in the morning and at night to let the whole town know the time. You'll hear it many times dark. during your stay. It's a beautiful sound. And you'll love it too, I think. I look forward to hearing it then. Anything else you'd like to know about? Uh, yeah, that. Yes, actually, Polly. Could you tell me about the shops around here? Shops? Well, there aren't many. It is a small town, after all. You can do most of your shopping at the Milk Barn convenience store. Yo, I do kind of like this music, run it though. On, you do care. I'm sure you'll get to like them. The A&G Diner is a great place to eat. They might be open even if my kitchen is closed. If you want to go to a bar, there are two. The Galaxy <laughs> of Terror and the Sweary 65. Absolutely. I don't care much for either of them. Bars are for the younger folk. We also have a gas stand, of course. The art gallery and even a gunsmith. You should be able That's to funny, it's not going to permit the term you, if you put the quotations around it. Well, Mr. Morgan, I'd better start cleaning up. You just take it easy. I'll bring your coffee out in a moment. Thank you, Polly. I have to warn you, though. I am very particular about my coffee. The very best you have, please. I understand. I'll be right back with it. Is this game just cutscenes? What is this? <laughs> Look with interest. <laughs> oh, right. He said he got a message in his coffee creamer. Did you see that, Zach? Clear as a crisp spring morning. F. K. In the coffee. I knew I could count on it. Never fail. Now then, let's get going. <laughs> this is like Stranger Goes to Strange Town, except for the town is normal and it's the stranger who's strange. Like, that's what it feels like. What a weird character. Alright, yeah, I'm background music. FK in the coffee. 
<laughs> Jaren, you're in luck. I can change the blood color. I can turn the blood off. Does this have... That's actually kind of cool. I can change the controls. Frick in the coffee. <laughs> I kind of want to just switch the ZL and ZR buttons, or the, the, the triggers and the bumpers, just because I feel like it's more natural to use ZL to look and R to attack, but it's not, I'll leave it as is, not that big of a deal. Hey, let's say my sound settings. Okay, good. Swag. Got my collectible. I guess we go this way now. As he takes five seconds to open the door. I can buy more $35 crackers. Buy Polly. Haha, <laughs> does Polly want a cracker? Haha. <laughs> Jokes. Oh, how many enemies did I defeat? 32. Yes. I got $210 for that. Dang. Because those medals give you money. You can go fishing in this game? Never mind. This game's great. I take back anything I may have said. This game's fantastic. car <laughs> this music <laughs> office open 9 to 17 Mr. Wolf universal basic income <laughs> so how dare much to thank for preparing a car for me a pleasant surprise Kazak. let's take it for a spin <laughs> yang gang support the yang gang would, would York vote, vote for Yang? Of course. I have to tell you, Zach, this place simply amazes me. The keys were left on the front hood. Nobody stole the car. Values. This town has what the country needs. Values. Let's head over to the sheriff's department. I will say the, the voice acting is not... I have a boost? Holy crap, okay. I have wipers and signals? Yo. That's kind of dope. I like. Alright. Oh, I'm sorry. Oh my gosh. You can check. Click it to check all the way behind, and you do that, check your blind spots. What? What is this? Oh my gosh, this controls like a nightmare. <laughs> it is. <laughs> Holy crap. I get out. It has windshield wipers. Oh wait, that that's blinker. No, turn it off. Okay, I don't know how to expect me to control my speed because these buttons are are, are manual. Oh frick. Wait, do we drive on the right side? Yeah, we drive on the right. I don't like that it's first person though. Oh my gosh. This game cannot be serious. I have a color in place. <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> he 
This is so funny. Oh, it's a siren. Oh, and I have to get there before the time runs out. Alright, we're gonna try to pass this guy because he's taking forever. Alright, we're passing. I hate this. <laughs> no. Actually, I, I do kind of want to... Oh, I should have saved. How do I... I'm going the wrong way, aren't I? Alright, you know what? We're doing a U-turn. Here we go, boys. Oh, there we go. Next. That's not a passing lane, buddy. <laughs> Listen. Wait, hold on. I forgot to... Okay, there we are. This is so funny. <laughs> Why would you make your car like this? Sick air time. <laughs> oh, this is great. I think I gotta go past that bridge over there. You just break like on a dime. All right, so what we're gonna do is we are going to we check that way. That oh, ow. That way, that way, and we're just gonna take a go for it. Driving, Adam, you were a driving instructor. Was that was that good enough? This doesn't actually control. <laughs> Listen. Listen. <laughs> this was me when I first started learning. Oh my gosh. I don't even have to use the car, I could just run everywhere. Oh, there's a phone. Oh, uh, let me here. Let me park real quick. There we go. <laughs> At least I'm consider. <laughs> Y'all mind if I park my car real quick? <laughs> Zach, is there something here that you want to check out? We're supposed to go through Anna Graham's file at the sheriff's office, but if you want to act on a hunch, then I'm with you. Yeah, I want to save so I can hit somebody and see what happens. What a game. So this is a trading card over here. <laughs> Honestly, when I, when I went to LA, I was terrified that we were going to be hit because the traffic was horrible. I'm so glad we weren't. This game is amazing. I'm so glad I spent my my money on this. There we go. There we go. Yeah, I went uh, in 2017 for a convention thing for the place I interned at because the the bigger not headquarters, but it's like it's um. A networking thing, not networking. It's a network of um, thing. Uh, how much is this game right now? Uh, I don't think it's on sale anymore. 
That's fair too. Uh, I think this game's normally like thirty dollars. I think I paid fifty for it. Way better than Nash. Yeah. I don't know. I I prefer Nash's to LA's, but I was only there for a week. Yeah, I don't know how much the game is. It was on sale for like fifteen. Which I think was 50% off, so it should be if I go for 30. The exterior woodwork is spectacular. Don't you agree, Zach? I'm not even moving at all. It's all just cutscenes. All dang country ham. Pleasure to meet you, Agent Morgan. We've been expecting you. I'm Thomas McLean, the sheriff's assistant. Oh, like <laughs> FBI Special Agent Francis York Morgan. Please just. He call just me said your name. name. Why what did you have to show him your badge? Very well then, Agent Agent York. I believe I owe you a thank you for retrieving my belongings <laughs> from my car. <laughs> they are. Thanks. No, no. I just I think. I mean, they're doing it to be like, oh, these people are quirky. So I look at how they stand weird. Oh yeah, that's who died. So she was such a bright and lovely girl. Did you know her well? Well, no, not really. But it's a very small town. I'm sorry. It's just that this is the first really big case I've ever seen. Oh, that's prejudice. I understand. Just what's prejudice? Can I have a look at Anna's file now? Y yes, of course. The sheriff told me to let you through to the meeting room. I lost the key to the cabinet where the files are. Why didn't you take a look around while I go look for it? Okay. Let me know when things are ready. Oh, yeah. That is Zach, prejudice. Thomas appears to be the kind and sensitive type. Totally at odds with the monarch. Almost a good setting for a cartoon. They're like, how do we make this character seem nice? Let's make them act like they're about to have a panic attack every five seconds. Or not have a panic attack, but just like, ugh. It's very much like how, like taking the stereotypes for someone who's like nice. He has e-girl posture. <laughs> e-girl before e-girls were a thing. I can just steal this? Okay. Dang. I can shave? Never mind. Best game ever. Oh, heck yeah. Zach, there's a name written on this dumbbell. Arnold. I haven't met anyone by that name yet. Why is he Could moving like that? This you just hold it. Shaving what simulator. <laughs> shaving simulator 2020. I want to see what happens if I go to shave. I don't know what I expected. Is that it? Am I done? This man didn't have any hair anyway. Oh, I get money for shaving. <laughs> oh, a trading card. I didn't actually find a turkey sandwich, guys. I found a trading card of a turkey sandwich. <laughs> Why would you put collectibles in this game? Oh my gosh. Oh, there's Thomas. Or he's talking about someone named Thomas. No, Arnold was the thing. <laughs> this game's trying to push the socialist agenda. Find the key. 
You want to play Marvel Legendary? <laughs> yeah. Oh, it's in the, <laughs> it's in the fridge. <laughs> hey, where's your copy of Marvel Legendary? Oh, in the fridge behind the, the eggs. Is this the one you were looking for? Uh, no. This is a gray squirrel. Sorry, that's not the key. Nothing particularly special about the gray squirrel, I'm afraid. You can find them in the U.S., Canada, and in England, too. A gray Fun squirrel. fact. What was I thinking? About the gray squirrel. But we're looking for a southern flying squirrel right oh, now. Of course, a southern flying squirrel. <sighs> what is this? Oh. Very cool. Very deep demolco. Let's go find. Well, let me look through all this stuff. There might be a trading card here. In the evidence locker of this police station. Oh boy, I hope I find Blue Eyes White Dragon or Dark Magician. Nope. Fun fact, run through doors. It's faster. At least it tells me what I can interact with. I, I do appreciate that. <gasps> Yo, what? You could change your outfit? Also fair. Should I change my outfit? I have workaholic, which is, I can't rotate him. Oh my gosh, it does. Just for the face though, the hands stay the same. I'm gonna go with this one. Cleaning. You can wash your clothes? There shouldn't be anything in here. It makes it hard to become sleepy for a short while and recovers a little tiredness. Okay. So I can have 15 items. But it doesn't look like stacks contribute to that number. Okay, interesting. Oh, the dumbbell isn't an item. I thought the dumbbell was going to be like a weapon. I guess because it belongs to someone. Okay. Did I find a trading card? George's locker that he keeps unlocked like an idiot. Gosh, George. Emily's locker. I'm curious as to what's inside. I'm sorry. Bruh. And I want to see what's in this room. Origin. No doubt this is Thomas's work, too. Whoever gets to marry him will be spoiled rotten. Oh. <laughs> Ponytailed flying squirrel key. I forgot which type of flying squirrel he said, but, you know, we got two now. So, it's better than nothing. Also, what is the heck is this? What is that? Oh, I love that I can do this. I can just play the game like this now. 
Wait. Line it up with his head. Actually, line it up with the middle of the screen. There we go. There we go. <laughs> yeah. I'm not going to do that, though. Alright. Can I... Any more rooms? I don't want to go downstairs. <laughs> Wooly Wooly. I don't remember which one you said. Oh, that's nice. So it eliminates the the wrong key. I like that. Sheriff's office. Okay. It's probably you found the key. The other one. I think so. Did but you see? that's okay. Ah, ah. You don't know your squirrels, do you? This isn't the right key holder. This is a Siberian oh, flying squirrel. It's closer to a land-based squirrel. Of course it is. Flying squirrel is I'm such an idiot. Flying squirrel, and has a standing tail while the southern has a hanging tail. But we're looking for a southern flying squirrel right now. Gosh. You sure do know a lot about squirrels. I thought I shaved. Why do I still have hair? Found the key. I hope so. Cause it's quirky. Like how Otacon from Metal uh, Gear Solid. Was, no, this is a sugar glider. Was right, obsessed with anime here. or whatever. The sugar this guy's probably obsessed with squirrels. Costume. It has shorter hair and a oh longer my gosh, a sugar glider. You can really see its muscle definition on this image, can't you? But we're looking for a southern flying squirrel right now. Zach, can you tell these things apart? Okay. More keys. Because instead of labeling your keys with a tag that tells you what they're for, you instead label them with rodents. It makes a lot of sense. <laughs> Trevecca's favorite game. I can't even talk to the officer. I can just observe him. One warden desk. That I can observe in two different locations. Oh my gosh, this game really is an open world. Yo. Okay. Damn, my boy be sleeping. Is that all we have in here? I'm just blinding that guy with my light. <laughs> Adam. <laughs> There's something by the toilet. I'll hold up a collectible. Quick, Google if this is the right flying squirrel. I'm kind of scared they're pulling a thing where it's like the last item you give will be the correct one. Hopefully we bring in another corporate scene though that'll maybe end with a little vacation. Wait, it didn't give me this option with the, the other prisoner. Dang, that's kind of whack. Wait, what? I'm sorry? I don't know. Why is there a shooting range? 
right down the hall from the jail. I'm sorry. Okay, we got two more scroll keys. One of these has, why, why did my Google activate? One of these has to be right. Oh my gosh. Insert joke about America and shootings. Jeez though, why would you have a gun range there? All right, let's get our scroll facts on. You found the key. I hope this is the right one. Can I skip the dialogue? <laughs> Dude, uh, someone had an ulterior motive with that. This time. Oh my gosh, it's a Siberian Sorry. chipmunk. Wrong I'm such key. an idiot. A Siberian American. chipmunk? <laughs> This species lives in northern Japan on the island of Hokkaido. They're actually quite a popular pet. So it isn't even a squirrel. But we're looking for a southern flying squirrel right now. Some game dev thought this was the funniest thing. I guarantee you found it. The key. They were That's the right one. laughing hysterically. <laughs> I found it. Yes. Yes. A southern flying Finally. squirrel. Thank you so much. I'll bring the files right in, so please go to the meeting room. <laughs> His okay. mouth. I'll be waiting for you. <laughs> Smile. Well, Zach, we just got here and we've cracked a big case what of the heck? Was that th I don't know if that was the key I found in the toilet or not. I don't know if I'd say he's the he's he's a you guys but like Age 18, she just recently graduated from high school. This that year. was unnecessary. Her dream <laughs> was to move out to the city and become a model. But for the time being, she was working in the AMG Diner here in town. She lived with her mother, Sally. <laughs> Sally spelled S L A S A L L I. Her mother is unemployed and lives on the insurance money from her husband's accident. Oh, my type of woman. After all, it's a small town with a low cost of living. Financially, they seem to get by fine, and they led normal lives. A normal life is exactly what a curious teenager doesn't want. It's all starting to make sense, Zach. I don't know if it is. I don't know what happened. What? So some teenage girl died? City folk, huh? No. No, I take that back. All of them can't be as bad as him. Well, some should have better manners. Huh. Is that a donut? This is a good no, biscuit. No, biscuit. Sorry. I've never tasted a biscuit this delicious. Where in town can I get these? Oh, actually, I, well, I, I baked them myself. Oh, that's amazing. What are you doing in law enforcement? <laughs> They're very particular about biscuits, I'll have you know balance of milk and butter you've achieved here oh my agent morgan the autopsy's ready you are welcome to accompany me to the greenvale general hospital i'm sorry Emily, you come too Thomas, we were stay here and tidy up these files <laughs> yes sir we're going to One use the car outside in game day ago let's get going you we were walking around town police investigation but our inspections are killing ghosts and i'm hoping and he just went on a tangent about a biscuit that looks like a donut. Let's give that ghost. Pepper Ridge Farm remembers. This definitely had to be inspired by Twin Peaks. There's no way. Squirrel 
keys were scary. Well, hey, someone who has a fear of squirrels is going to have a heck of a time doing that mission. Also, there was no combat. I killed 32 enemies. Two, like, quote-unquote levels General ago. General Hospital is down the road by the lake. It's too far to walk. Come on, get in the car. If I'm riding in a car, George, I prefer no, to be driving. No, no, you don't. Can you provide a car for me? What are you talking about? You don't even know how to get there. Which is another good reason for me to drive. I thought they gave him a car. I need to learn my way around town. Oh, man. He was driving the, the cop Very car. Well. Then I'll ride with you. I want to keep an eye on you. Fair enough. Just one thing, Agent Morgan. Your involvement in this case is limited. That means you don't have to learn your way around town. <laughs> Writing. George. If I'm driving a car, can I ride in the passenger minutes. seat? I prefer to ride in the passenger seat if I'm driving. Oh my gosh. Can I pick whatever car I want? Oh, please tell me I can. <gasps> Yo. Interesting. So you can make the choice to either go with him or go separate. I love driving in the passenger seat. What car should I take, gamers? No, it doesn't. Look at this stupid poncho I'm wearing. I'm taking this car. Oh, the diner. The diner's open from nine to thirteen. Agent Morgan, get us there quickly, but drive within the speed limit. Just because you have a badge doesn't mean you can drive like a maniac. George, what are you, his mother? We just need to get the, Take the pretty green results. bug. Agent I can't. Morgan, isn't it makes me walk if I go over there. Give him a little flack. Hmm. Well then, Agent York, let's get going. Sure, sounds good. I can't even see behind me. Oh, hold on, I gotta turn the wipers on. <laughs> it's like game mechanic. Oh my gosh. Unfortunately, relationships and I are leading strangers. <laughs> I don't get on very well with women. You might be surprised to hear. That's because advance of white green is like that at my age. I'm you going in a circle. Hold on. Like Hold on. If you don't, they can cut scars on your face. There just we like go. Just like yours, right? George, is this an interrogation? I see you're a seasoned professional. Uh, but let's not talk about my scar. It was caused by a uh, problem. Well, she got you good. Terribly good. It'll fade away, and nobody will notice it in a week. A week? It's not that light of a wound. So, Emily, tell me, is there really a need for a full-time sheriff in a small town like this? I'm sure it is small to your city eyes, but any gathering of people leads to all kinds of problems. Fights, runaways, stray pets. You're fixing it on violent crime. Listen, Our job is to guide the people I, I, I passed the IRL driving test. I, I didn't pass the deadly premonition driving test. There's a reason why I didn't take it. Because I'm going the wrong way. This makes me glad that I wasn't born here. Did you say something, Agent Morgan? No, nothing. Very rude. I was just reflecting on a little of this. Well, we're in the middle of a Adam's just cringing. Keep your mind on the matter. I don't understand okay. this. Right now, is driving. Deli premonition. <laughs> Alright, how do I get the trail I can take? If I go 
go this way, it just loops me around. Where is the main road? Is there no main road? Oh, there it is. I'm idiots to the left. Oh, blinker. Advanced blinker gameplay. Can they give me third person view? Alright, hold up. I got a. Where are the controls? Oh no, don't tell me. Oh, it doesn't tell you. On the phone. Look at my trading cards. Oh. He sure he sure is an angel. to fill the cars up with gas? Okay, taking your finger off the um, gas slows down. I am going to know. I sure am. Make a U turn. There we go. Thank you. I try my best. Guys, I swear I'm a good driver. Yo, can you speed up the wipers? This car is so sensitive. What did I get money for? Listen, I just want to know how far the game is going with its deep mechanics and lore. It's a pretty big hospital. I guess they wanted to be ready for. Uh, what the heck? He just like popped poison. No, no. <laughs> Why did he move like, like that? Towns prosperous as lumber day. Can't you imagine now, though? My mother always talked about how energetic this town used to be. Almost like a gold rush, she used to say. Impressive. Wiper the deep wiper. Beyond your understanding, I'm sure. Yes, I'm sorry to say that it is. And that's why this case is our problem. There really isn't any need for you to get too involved. Gosh, what a tsunami. Jeez. Uh, 
I like it that none of them are wearing like head coverings at all, but he has the poncho on over his shirt, but the hood is down. Also, when can I go fishing? Hello, Sheriff. <sighs> Freckly Fiona. They went all out with these characters. Hi there, Fiona. We're here to see Usha. You know where he is? I think Dr. Johnson is in the computer room. The computer room? In the hospital? <laughs> nice to meet you, Mr. FBI agent. The computer room is where our employees share a computer. So they can all play RuneScape nice to together. I'm FBI special agent. <laughs> Another great quote. Besides, that scar on your face is the biggest rumor in town. Rumors get exaggerated as they spread, even in the countryside. What's that you're reading, if I may ask? Liar's House. Liar's House of Leaves. You haven't heard of this yet? It's a recent bestseller mystery. Set in the U.S., a small traditional North American town close to the Canadian border. A peaceful, traditional place. However, that peaceful town was shattered by a terrible crime. The murder of a local girl. And that incident causes grief and sadness to everyone in town. But everyone feels the seditious, heinous evil still lurking, alive. Yes, much like the situation right now here in Greenvale. Fiona, don't say that. <laughs> Sorry, I Yo, shouldn't have said that. Yo, it parallels the with game. Fiona dead and all. Don't worry. Books are written Mind blown. It's good you're enjoying it. What we're faced with here is a terrible crime committed in a real world. But it's much different from that of a novel. So there's no need to apologize. Thank you, Agent York. This main character is so weird. He's like, I like to be alone and in charge, but also like super nice to everyone. Okay, cool. Oh, I was going to say earlier, the voice acting is not too bad. All things considered. Okay. Computer lab. Whatever that may be. I just have free range of the hospital now. Yo, let's go. Oh, never mind. The computer lab is this way. Ugh. Going down here. Exactly. That's why I became a fed in the first place. My mom always telling me what to do. I said, not anymore, mom. Once I become a fed, it's all over. Now she can't make it. It's the, the, the music that plays. Background, it's BGM is background music. Do you see this though? The, the do not enter signs are, hold up. They're just flat. It says do not enter. But it's just flat. It's not even like an object. This game came out on the PS3. That. Whatever. I shouldn't judge game developers too hard. I, I don't know how to develop a game. We couldn't find him. Fiona needs to check her information. No, I don't think so. Does the doctor like playing games? Game just turns into Paper Mario stickers. What do you mean? There's a message on the computer, and a card key already set in place. Also, there's a chess tournament. The king passes the rook and meets the bishop. The knight takes a pawn along for the queen. What does that all mean? It's a simple puzzle. <laughs> Zach, let's take him up on this Adam, no. Right. <laughs> I'm so. King passes rook and meets bishop. Knight takes a pawn to the queen. 
fucking up. Look. Bishop. Knight pawn. Doctor awakes below with the deceased. What was the the point of that? Another code? But there's nowhere to insert a password. <laughs> I don't Four like that games. quote, Adam. <laughs> I'm going to get Fiona to call Usha up here right now. No need, George. The message appeared with the card key. It's telling us where to use it. This is not the time to be joking around, Agent Morgan. Is that Dr. David Usher Hater? Is it sounds like David deceased. Hater. With Anna. Below being underground. <laughs> really? For real? Simple. The sheriff Simple. sounds like like snake. Then it's time like, There's no time to mess around, Agent Morgan. Little game. Colonel. Uh, this horror game. Yeah, that's what I was promised it was. So far I'm just running around. Wait, hold up. Where are we going? Downstairs at yeah. I do like this music though. Yeah, for real. Yeah, I know what you're talking about. He just sounds like Snake if Snake didn't smoke as much. What? Okay. Yeah, it, it kind of does have like that vibe. I'm gonna have to look up who the composer was. Whoa. What is that hallway design? What the heck? The Incredibles. Cowboy Bebop, Incredibles, Crossover 1. Thank you, camera. Wait, there's no button I can click to move the camera back? That's fun. Okay, cool. Ah, oh, Colonel. There's a dead girl. Ah, oh, Agent Morgan. I don't think it's David Hater. I I kind of rec. I I think I recognize the sheriff's voice though. Oh baby, there's a metal. Let's see how much they're selling crackers for. Thirty-five fifty-six for a pack of four. At least saving is quick. This does remind me so much of Heavy Rain, though. But instead of the detective, the FBI agent having like a really sophisticated. Oh, sure. Sorry to keep you waiting. <laughs> the ah, you made it. Let's get started, shall we? <laughs> this is Agent Morgan from the FBI. Hmm, nice to meet you. I'm Usha Johnson, the doctor in this hospital. FBI oh my Special gosh. Agent Francis York Morgan. Please call me York. Everyone calls me that. <laughs> Very well. Dr. Usha. Are you a forensic practitioner? Let's just say I've dealt with corpses before. That battle of wits, by the way. Could you create <laughs> that yourself? wearing a gold mm -hmm. chain. I just wanted to see if our FBI agent could handle the task. I see. Well, it was pretty fun. Oh, I'm glad you liked it. Oh my gosh, Japan. We don't have much time. We need those autopsy results. I, I don't know. I had I had a thought. Kind of challenging it's gone. Obstructing an investigation. You've angered the monarch. Also, his stethoscope is behind his badge. 
from an or at least it looked like it was. Usher for Smash. <laughs> Yo, Usher Johnson for Smash. Be between 20 and 2200 hours. Uh, that's still quite early for such a crime to take place. Note that there are two exterior wounds, pressure marks around the neck, and a long cut running from chest to abdomen. Blood marks on her right hand tell us she was gripping something round in her right hand. His, like, yeah, the, not not like a detective or police badge. Her skull is also like the fragile, badge that says, hey, I work here. Unrelated to the cause of death. But what else? Uh, name tag? Probably it's not a name tag, though. It's a badge. She was killed. I don't card id i guess I, I don't know what to call it now i first thought death by suffocation yeah name badge due to not like <laughs> <neck>. <laughs> he's got like an fbi badge that says like md I now have a different conclusion. usher johnson md the direct cause of death was loss of blood from yeah look it's clipping <laughs> it's clipping <laughs> Oh, that's great. Which means she was cut up while she was still alive. This would yes, be interesting uh, as a team. This is it, it's clearly what they're going for. It was for. inserted beneath the sternum and then cuz when we down. went to when he the went to bed there was like a previously on organs is what actually killed her. So it's being episodic. The nails are clean and with no skin cells from the while attacker. still being she also doesn't open appear world, to have been which bound, nor bad seems kind of weird. She was apparently killed without resistance. The most tragic thing, however, was that she was unable to speak her story to anyone who could hear her cry. Falling in love with her corpse. What is a speaker for the dead? Perpetrator cut out Anna's tongue. Well, I believe she was drugged first Yo. to phase her consciousness, and then the killer. Never did. mind. I take back what I said. Now, the killer most likely has a deep, traumatized past concerning women. He probably cannot converse with them normally. Cutting out the tongue. I'm curious if there's anything else in the in the Deadly Premonition like series. Truly hardcore sadist. <laughs> he must get off on watching women suffer, especially when they can't answer back. Now, he watched as the blood. Dang, this guy is psychoanalyzing the killer. Gradually grew based cold. on her not having a tongue. The case in Seattle in 1985 was much like. Usha, please, limit your report to your findings as a doctor. Criminal profiling is my job. Oof. You're wrong, also. Anna died fully, deeply, painfully aware of what was happening to her. <laughs> but, uh... Tell me, what? what time did it stop raining on the okay. night Anna was killed? Uh... Just before I went to bed, right after the movie on TV ended, so around 1 a.m. What movie was it? An American Werewolf in London. Uh, directed by John Landis, 1981. So the rain stopped, accompanied by the ending song of Blue Moon. George, would you mind if I examined Anna myself? What more do you hope to find? I'm sure I mentioned that I have a Checking personal interest her in pulse. cases like these. <laughs> you guys mind if I examine her myself? Checks pulse. She's dead. What the? His age isn't immediately apparent, though he can't be that old. Looks like a trustworthy doctor. Okay. Get get the cameras, boys. The camera's boy. There it is. Okay, what can we examine? Fake finger memories. She was holding something in her hand, but it moved around six hours after death. Circular with a relief shaped like a peace mark. I kind of like this, though. Like you observing. <laughs> For observation. 
like this is more than a horror game, which I'm kind of happy about. Stunning even in death. Traces of evaporated liquid around the eyes. She must have cried before she was murdered. Tongue is running me. Look at the edge of the stump. I don't want to. What was the point of that? From her lack of resistance, I'd say that yeah, those injuries the... happened very quickly. Unable to speak, she was then left to cry herself to death. Didn't we already... Zach, it's all starting to come together. Like, determine that? The perpetrator stayed with her for at least two hours until it stopped raining. At the estimated time of her death, it was still raining. But you can still see tear marks on her cheeks. That means she was killed under a roof somewhere. Those are some Jeez. strong tear marks. She was then carried into the woods after it stopped raining. Hmm. <clears throat> there, there's one other thing. Her tongue was removed with a very blunt knife. In fact, it's more likely it was simply chopped off. Was it now? Asha, are you a passionate oh. man? Well, not particularly. I mean, but I am man enough should the moment call for it. George, how about you? I'm very passionate. Yes. Especially when it comes to women. Gosh, you want to talk about scars? Has to do with anything. George, the perpetrator is just like you. I guess that's fair, but they didn't mention mascara. They just said tears. He's a passionate kisser. So it was a death. Ah, the perpetrator. Bit off. Yo, <laughs> George, calm down, bro. <laughs> Dang, George, save some for the rest of us. Like this. But this is still a big lead. I thought this was just going to be, like, some game about, like, a small town mystery. Not, like, oh. Oh, her tongue was bit off. Jackpot, Zach. Shame, but our old-time all-American sightseeing tour just came to an end. This case is now under the jurisdiction of the FBI. I'm assuming commitment. I'll need you to assist me in the investigation. What in the hell do you mean, Agent Morgan? I know I said I was passionate, but you can't think <laughs> I did this. <laughs> George wouldn't. That's not why I'm assuming command, George. You're a suspect just as much as every other passionate man on Earth. Let me show you something. George, would you bite a woman's tongue out? This game is weird, but I am intrigued. So I'm going to see it through to the end, streaming it. I'm not going to play this game by myself. I would get there you too go. bored. Amazing, huh? I'm sure you have a lot of questions, but most of the details are top secret. George, Emily, we should be going. No need to stay here any longer. Okay. I have to sign the release. Just give me a moment. <laughs> What's that, the body? Can you sign here? I'll go on ahead. I can't take it any longer down here. Bishop takes queen. His rook takes your queen. Then your knight takes rook. And checkmate. This is written like a TV show. First victory in the Grandmaster ranking. I'm sorry, the guy checking the dead body of this young girl who was murdered was playing chess. Oh shoot, there's gonna be combat. Hmm? Everything's all spooky. Usha, baby. Zach, they're here. I mean, so far, Usha is the best character in the game. Sweet. Alright. My initial plan was to play until 12, but I kind of want to keep going. 
Okay, here. We'll save. We'll, we'll go through the horror, and then we'll call it a night. Not that I really have to be in Lake tomorrow, because I don't really do anything. In life. But, yeah, let's go, baby. Oh, you know what? I probably have to do... Let's go through the door. No, that's the door I came out of. I think it's working. Well, that's just wasting the knife's health. I'm not gonna do that then. Alright, door it is. Oh, they're gone. <laughs> blood wall. Blood wall, blood wall. Oh, cutscene. <laughs> what is. What? Is he having like a psychotic break or something? What? Oh my gosh, there's gonna be something in one of these, isn't there? Watch. Told you. Bullets. This is like Silent Hill Shattered Memories. Except for instead of just running away, I have to do slow combat. Watching some girl run in a red dress. Deli premonition. Yeah, I think he's crazy too. This is definitely going to be more than just like, oh, small town killer. Oh, frick. Come here. Yes. Oh, accidental headshot. I'll take it. Shot. Oh shoot me! Double kill. Let's go. Yeah, I'm kind of intrigued about the whole Zach thing. I want to see where that goes. But this is like the exact same combat as Resident Evil. But in like a Silent Hill esque setting. Are you going to the bathroom? Oh yeah. In the oh. What did they leave on the toilet? A stabilizing. <laughs> Let me. Oh, this one has infinite rounds. Okay, that's good. No, I don't got time for that. I got these zombies. Amazing. Ooh, okay. Dang, they do be taking a while though to die. Could you Why is her hitbox still there? These hitboxes do be staying there. Okay, also, every time it shows an enemy, it plays that stupid sound effect. Yes. Stay, blood wall. Oh, frick. Got him. I don't think I missed anything. Yeah. What? what? Yeah. Oh, you're alive. I killed you. Jeez. Oh, another one must have been summoned. Never mind. The voices are creepy, but this isn't scary though. It's just kind of it's really it's goofy. Gorsh Mickey. 
I killed that girl. Oh, they're saying they don't want to die. That's actually kind of cool. Now we gotta wait for the. There we go. Oh, I can't walk and reload. Of course not. Why is someone crying? I don't like that. Amazing. I'll save you in a sec. I want to see these things. Okay, I'm not screwed. Actually, no. I get money if I find my if I kill my enemies. Operating room, it is. That's dead. Alright, dang. Shut up. I'm coming. Gosh. Oh, I don't like this. I want the collectible first. be a boss fight. <laughs> Bro, that was my trading card. Oh, key card. Oh, frick, what is that note? Oh, jeez. The rotation of the camera for the gun is momentum based. That is something. Use it. Okay, there we go. <laughs> I would love to play. <laughs> I should hook up a GameCube controller and play it with that. Okay, I didn't... No, is that... Oh, I can sleep. Do I even need sleep? <sighs> no, I don't. Oh, there's no time in here. Okay, interesting. Yo, another knife. Let's go. Yeah, time is not a, a thing in here. Oh, I'm guessing sleeping probably heals me a little. Let me just do that real quick. Oh, I missed something. <laughs> Dude, someone left a black... It's an infinite supply of lollipops. Okay, no. Yes, it is. Yeah, that's crazy. <sighs> I'm sorry. Oh, the wall. You're right. It is free money, though. Ah, but it wastes my hunger. Okay. I'm meant to satiate myself. I go here. And we get. What's.
Alright. Have a good night, Jaren. Hopefully you come back and join me whenever I decide to play this game again. Which I don't understand where it wants me to go. Not there. frames per second. Yes. There we go. Jeez. Night. Bye, Jaren. I'll take it. <sighs> this game doesn't seem very survival horror-esque if you're just dropping stuff. The wheelchair, okay. Oh, you are here to me. Yes. This is why you push stuff. I don't think that's how those boxes would work. But what do I know? This is just Silent Hill. Here, over here. <laughs> oh my gosh. Ouch. Don't attack me, I won't kill you. Oh, collectibles. Bullseye. I wish there was a way to like peek around corners. Giving me the health packs. All right, we are going to save and call it a night because. <laughs> This is not what I expected this game to be. I don't know whether to be like disappointed or not. Hey, thanks for watching. I really appreciate it. I'm glad that I had, you know, at least one viewer, but I had two. So, you know, that's a plus. Oh yeah, what was that other game I had I wanted to play? 2064 Readling Memories. Okay, I'll have to stream that one at two at some point. All right, have a good night, Adam. And I get to go to this screen now. Yeah. With my Twitter. Good night.